She's just a girl and she's on fire. I started gymnastics when I was two years old at a local gym, and then when I was about five years old, my mom decided to open up her own gymnastics facility, and that was when I started to get serious with gymnastics, and I became a competitive gymnast, and I've met many, many lifelong friends, and we've had so many crazy times together from competitions, going away from meets, going to clinics, and just hanging out with each other. Why was Julia the best student you ever had? Well, Julia is very talented in gymnastics. Beam wasn't her favorite, though, but I would have to say Floor was her best. What do you think, Jules? Yes. And it was very fun to coach her because she tried anything and she was not scared of anything. And that makes a good gymnast. What was your favorite memory with Julia? Coaching Julia and my favorite memory of her is how good she was on floor because she was never afraid and she always tried something and when she tried it she usually succeeded and did her skills. What was it like being my teammate? You were always happy, you always made practice fun and you never cried. What was your favorite memory with me? Every day in the gym you came and pinched my cheeks and you were always like, oh my Mickey. Describe me as a teammate. Um, you're very hardworking, and you always know how to make people laugh, and you're just really fun to be around. Overall, great gymnast. Um, being Julia's teammate was the best experience of my life. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like being my teammate? When I started USAJ, um, like I didn't really know you, and we were never really that close, but as like time went on and as I like moved up levels and you moved up level levels, we definitely got closer so it was kind of nice sharing like that experience. What was your favorite memory with me? When we went up to Boston and we went to Yellow Jackets and practiced with their team. What was it like being my teammate? Being teammates with Julia, at first we didn't really get along but gradually as we gained more levels and she realized I wasn't a mean person, I don't know where she got that from, but we became friends and we used to hang out all the time at her old house and we did things. <laughs> What's your favorite memory with me? We both broke our wrists at the same time and one of the gymnastics judges, Judge Sean, was one of our coaches that summer and he was so mean to me and Julia and was really like, you guys need to do one arm push ups and one arm handstands and one arm back handsprings <laughs> on the beam and one arm everything. I loved coaching you, it was so much fun um, watching you grow over the years from a beginner gymnast to a high level competitive gymnast. Um, I loved how dedicated you were working through injuries and um, coming in and conditioning and staying strong while you were healing. And um, it was always a lot of fun to bring you to a competition and have you go out and shine and earn medals and place well. That was always very rewarding and exciting. And I loved just kind of sharing those moments with you. Going into my senior year in the summer, I realized that my injuries were way too much to handle and I couldn't continue to do gymnastics anymore, which was really hard for me to make a decision because it's been a part of my life for so long but I decided to start coaching and I'm so happy I did it. Coaching has given me the ability to use all of my knowledge from being a former gymnast and I get to use all my like tips and tricks with my gymnast now. I'm so happy that you transitioned from gymnast to coach um, instead of just being kind of done with the sport. So it's a nice opportunity to coach and share your love for the sport with the girls and I especially love having you co-coach with me. I get to have you in the gym and teach you some of the things that I know as a coach and, um, and I'd like to learn from you as well. What's your favorite thing about me coaching you? The show is fun. Cece, remember that time you killed a possum? <laughs> Stop! That was so sad. <laughs> you killed a seagull? I didn't mean to. Remember that time you were obsessed with flying squirrels? I still am. <laughs> Bright Stars has been my home away from home. I grew up there for the past 10, 15 years. I have made so many friendships and I'm still best friends with some of them today, even though we've all parted our ways and have gone, you know, different paths. But gymnastics has been probably one of the best experiences of my life and I can't wait to one day share these experiences with my daughter. It's nice to know when I